Ever found yourself wondering about the delectable allure of traditional Indian desserts? Have you ever tried your hand at making the creamy aromatic delight that is rice kheer? Rice kheer or chawal ki kheer is a classic Indian rice pudding, simmered in milk and sweetened with sugar. It's a dessert that not only satisfies your sweet tooth but also carries the rich legacy of Indian culinary traditions. To embark on this culinary journey, you will need half a cup of basmati rice, 1 liter of whole milk, half a cup of sugar, 4 to 5 crushed cardamom pods or half a teaspoon of cardamom powder, a pinch of saffron strands, 2 tablespoons of chopped nuts such as almonds, cashews, pistachios and a tablespoon of raisins. Start by washing the basmati rice thoroughly and soaking it in water for about 30 minutes. After soaking, drain the water. Next, in a heavy bottomed pan, pour the milk and bring it to a boil over medium heat, stirring occasionally to prevent the milk from sticking to the bottom of the pan. Once the milk starts boiling, lower the heat and add the soaked rice to the pan. Simmer this mixture on low heat, stirring occasionally to ensure the rice doesn't stick to the bottom. As the rice cooks and the milk thickens, which should take around 25 to 30 minutes, add sugar, crushed cardamom pods, saffron strands, chopped nuts, and raisins. Continue to cook on low heat until the rice is completely cooked, the milk thickens further, and the kheer reaches a creamy texture. Once the kheer reaches this desired consistency, it's time to turn off the heat and let it cool to room temperature. Serve it warm or chilled, depending on your preference, garnishing it with more chopped nuts before serving. Rice kheer is best served chilled and can be stored in the refrigerator for a few days. This is a dessert that has won hearts across many cultures in India. And remember, you can always adjust the sugar quantity to suit your taste preferences. In the vast tapestry of Indian cuisine, rice kheer holds a special place. It's a dish that's often served on special occasions, a sweet reminder of the rich, diverse flavors that define Indian food. So there you have it the recipe for a classic comforting dessert that's loved across India. A creamy aromatic sweet treat that's sure to impress your taste buds. For more such finger-licking recipes, do visit www.indianrecipebook.com. And while you are at it, don't forget to like, subscribe and share our videos. Your support means the world to us. Happy cooking! And remember, every dish is a chance to travel through the world of flavors right from your kitchen.